As you spend time this holiday season with the people you love and appreciate most in the world, I wanted to share my hope that you and your families will be well and happy. You are among the people I appreciate most in the world for your dedication to the young people of our community. I'm reminded every day that you do the most important work being done in Louisville. Whether it's teaching or making learning possible, you are building our community's future. At this time of year, when the hours of daylight are at their shortest, I'd like to share a couple of examples of how you have lit up the lives of JCPS students and our community as a whole. Each year, the staff at Slaughter Elementary, one of the schools participating in the JCPS Compassionate Schools Project, collects new and gently used items from families and friends. Then each student gets to choose at least one gift to give to someone else, such as a parent or a sibling. This annual event helps students understand the importance of giving and not just receiving at this time of year. It also shows students there is an abundance of compassion and holiday spirit in both their school community and their larger community. Another example is the student group called Leaders of Excellence at DOS, which is mentored by teacher Jeremy Scharf. This group developed a food drive to benefit Family Scholar House. Each student in the DOS group met with churches, community organizations, peers, and family members to spread the word about the work Family Scholar House does to support academics and families. The students themselves learned about the joy and the power of compassion and community service. There are so many more examples, but all these efforts have some things in common. They are inspired by your leadership and they begin in the classroom. In the new year, we will continue to focus on the classroom because for us, that is the center of the universe. And we will continue to provide the support and resources that are needed in the classroom so each and every child can gain both the academic and the behavioral skills they need to succeed. Part of that effort is ensuring that teachers and other critical resources are put where they are needed most to achieve the goals outlined in Vision 2020. You've heard a little bit about the new budget process for allocating teachers, and I welcome the opportunity to hear from you so we can ensure that we're giving our classrooms what they need to continue what's working. The new year brings our second first day of school and the opportunity to start fresh rested and uplifted by this season of giving. May you enjoy every moment with family and friends and know that you are appreciated beyond words. Happy Holidays.